to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Sarah and I put up a lot of fashion-y type of videos here on this channel. If you guys have been around for a while, you know that there are certain things that I really love. One of them being denim and finding a really good flattering pair of jeans because if you guys have seen all my other videos about jeans, you know that I've mentioned in my younger years I used to never want to wear jeans because I just felt them to be uncomfortable and I could never find a pair that was flattering and fit my body correctly and made me feel confident. I'm really excited today to be sharing a new brand that I discovered with you guys that I honestly think takes the cake for the best skinny jeans in my opinion, quality wise, like production wise and price point wise. That was a lot of wises. So I'm going to give you guys a quick review on this new brand, this new denim brand, and then I'm going to share with you guys two ways to style them more casually and two ways to style them a little bit more dressed up and put together. So here we go. So the brand of denim that I'm going to be sharing with you guys today is called Bleu Bleu. I believe I'm saying that correctly. Please excuse my poor French, even though I took French for many years of my life. I don't think it's paying off right now. In 2018, I really want to share with you guys quality brands that I believe are honestly like the best of the best where you should be spending your money and you know still some affordable options here and there but I'm really trying to move in the direction of filling my wardrobe with more quality good basics versus like a bunch of trendy stuff. This brand approached me and asked me if I'd like to do a review on their denim. I asked them first if I could like try out the denim for a couple months and then see how I felt about it and I'm giving you my full and honest opinion today guys. I've had these since like the beginning of maybe even November or December. It's been quite a while now and I am obsessed with them. So they sent me two pairs that are very similar because I believe one of the others was out of stock. So they're both these two navy like deep indigo, I'm really bad with the shades of blue, but you know, they're just like your classic blue jeans and this one doesn't have like the colored stitching where this one does. So I haven't worn these ones as much, but I have indeed put these ones to work and they are so comfortable, they flatter your body and the quality is what I really want to touch on because I feel like that is so important when you're investing in a nice pair of jeans. So I'm just going to use this pair as an example because as I said, they are both very similar. I'm going to quickly touch on some points and then we're going to get into the styling. So what I really appreciate about the brand is their quality and hard work that goes into every single pair of jeans. They're still fairly new. They started online last year or now 2016. So yeah, two years ago now. They originally began by selling their denim to custom boutiques in LA and then the demand kind of grew from that and they just launched their own website, which I think is really good because you know you're getting a quality pair of denim. They're from LA. Everything seems pretty ethical, which I'm a big fan of. And the price point is very fair, I think, considering the quality that you are getting in these jeans. So as you guys can see from me just holding these up, the wash on them is super high quality. They look like a really expensive pair of jeans and the fit is also super flattering. They're still stretchy and really comfortable to wear, but they're not overly stretchy to the point where the wash on them is gonna look really wonky when you put them on your body. I know I've done denim videos in the past and I've mentioned time and time again, the Jamie jeans by Topshop, which I still really like. I still think they're comfortable. They flatter the booty really well if you're a little bit more curvy. But to me, I always had an issue when I was going in there and trying on their like blue wash denim because the wash that I saw, like when I held the denim up, was not the wash that I got when I put it on my body. That really just shows a lack of quality, unfortunately, because a really good pair of denim will not change when you put it on your body. Like the, the wash and everything should remain the same, the stitching and everything like that. And these are, you know, that exact type of pair of denim. They do not change. They look great on your body. They look the same as they do when you're just holding them up. So those are some things that I really like about them. I like the pockets, how they're small, how they're placed kind of high so they're gonna give your booty that like lifted peaky look which I think is really great and yeah they're not even super high rise which usually I go for but these just work anyways which I feel like is a true sign that they are a winner in my book so I'm gonna get into the styling portion of this video we'll chat more about the jeans and all that stuff and I'll see you guys over there in a sec <laughs> Number one, this is one of the more like night out appropriate looks, I guess you could say. I just kept it really simple and kind of played with some more textures. I just thought it was simple because the jeans look so nice, so you don't really need to do that much to your outfit. So the top I'm wearing is just this like tight bodycon black off the shoulder top that I got from H&M. I have on some little dainty like gold hoops from H&M as well, just to kind of like jazz up and fancy up the look I guess you could say. Then I have this little red burgundy fringy jacket that I got in the summer. 
I believe it was from Saks and I believe it was from Lovers and Friends. Tula Rosa? Tula Rosa, I think. And I just think this is really fun. It's lightweight. Obviously, if you're going out in winter, you're going to need to put a bigger coat over top. But if you're at the bar, this is just kind of like a little added something, makes you look a little extra fancy. And then for shoes, I just decided to like spice it up again and add some different texture and a different print. So these are my like faux snake skin, alligator skin? Are they alligator or snake? I don't know. Some sort of reptile skin from Public Desire. Since they have black in them, I feel like they kind of tie in with the top. They get too crazy, but they do add a pop of fun, which I think is really great. Right, so this is the fancier look number two, I guess you guys could say. I'm using the same pair of denim that I was wearing in the previous outfit, just because I feel like this all dark look makes it a little bit more sophisticated and classy. So that's why I went with this pair again. I just paired it with this really nice, like, sleeveless or cap sleeve blouse that I actually thrifted along with this thinner kind of black duster coat I guess you could call it that I got at Forever 21 a couple years ago and then for the shoes I just threw on these velvet sock booties from Public Desire to so just really elevate the look and make it a little bit more classy. I decided to skip out on any of the jewelry just because I feel like there's a lot of detailing in the jacket and the top is very shiny so I didn't want to like overload the look but you could totally add like some simple earrings or a dainty little necklace just to tie it all together. more everyday type of looks. I switched up the denim snow I have on that kind of lighter wash pair with like the gold stitching that you guys can see. And I just kept this outfit extremely simple. I'm not gonna wear coats in this video just because my coats are so big and chunky and I feel like if I throw them on, you're not gonna be able to see anything underneath, which is like the real important stuff, you know what I'm saying? So for top, I just kept it super simple and wore this slightly cropped, just flattering striped sweater that I have from Frank and Oak Woman. I just really like the way that it hits pretty much exactly at the waistline of these jeans, which I feel like is a really flattering fit. And as you guys can see, the jeans fit really comfortably, really flattering on the booty. I think this would be a great look for school if you're going to class. It just is extremely easy. You throw on the sweater, you got the jeans. I paired it with my favorite Zara booties, the ones that have the zipper going up the front. I feel like these boots paired with skinny jeans just really make your legs look super long, which who doesn't want super long looking legs? And then just to show you guys how I would probably accessorize this since it is like negative a million degrees outside, I threw on this really cozy blanket scarf that I have from H&M. The colors don't interfere too much with the sweater that I'm wearing and I feel like it pairs really nicely with the shade of denim. And then obviously a big winter coat I'd have over top. Probably a hat as well, but I don't wanna make my head any more staticky than it already is. All right, and now for the final look, I kept this one even more casual and comfy mostly because I'm really obsessed with this sweater that I recently got from Urban Outfitters. It is literally like a duvet sweater. I paired this with a graphic tee underneath just to give the outfits more like detail and something to pop, just the red on the purple. I feel like it's a really nice contrast. And then yeah, I left the same pair of denim, the same booties just to like elevate the look, make my body look a little bit longer as I mentioned before. Since the sweater is a little bit more bulky and chunky, I just want to keep things very slim and narrow on the bottom. But all together, I feel like this look is a very comfy, cozy, once again, studying look, just, you know, leaving the house for a little bit, but you still want to look put together. And honestly, guys, the jeans are so comfy. I can bend to them. Do whatever I want in them so I just say they're an A plus in my books but as you guys saw these jeans are super versatile you can wear them easily in the day or in the night and I just think they're such a flattering fit that's gonna make you feel super confident and just overall great so definitely check them out down below if you guys are interested in getting your hands on them don't forget to use my code Sarah Dunk for 25% off everything else is gonna be linked down below hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one Mwah. Ta -da.